Species 7 here, welcome to the channel and welcome back to Farm Sim 25. Indeed, hope everybody's doing well. It is uh, a Tuesday today, the 10th of December. Alright, this is doing well. Needs rolling? Well, too bad. Once I realized how uh, unuseful our roller was, I uh, got rid of it. Anyway, we are uh, once again faced with a little bit of an issue. Um, being the consummate YouTube professional that I am and an expert in my trade, yeah, I once again forgot to turn the damn mic on and recorded an entire episode. <laughs> so, what I did was um, we did a couple of big harvests a sunflower harvest, a corn harvest. Um, I bought a corn header second hand. Um, you guys might have seen that, I'm not sure. And had an issue. I found out about halfway through the cornfield it didn't really fit our harvester. Um, it kept digging into the ground and the thing would start to dog leg across the... Yeah, not good, especially since I had a hired worker running it at the time. <laughs> yeah, tab back to him and I see this weird kind of diagonal skittish line going up the field and I go, oh, that's kind of weird. And then I look at his next line, he goes along, goes along, and then all of a sudden just starts dog licking really badly, and it's like, oh god. So yeah, um, I went to sell it, and I opened the store page, and realized that actually the next model of Harvester Up was on sale. And pretty cheap, I mean, it's a $200,000 Harvester. It was, I think, 97000 and change. Still a big chunk, and still did set me back. I had to do, I think, three more contracts to make up the money in difference. But uh, we got to keep that header, and the new header was pretty cheap. Plus, I sold our old one, and guess what? The very next time I opened the uh, thing, there's our old harvester. <laughs> It's now for sale as used equipment. Yeah. And at 40% off, that's more than I got for it. I got 48000 So, yeah. 6.9 hours usage on it over 11 months. Hmm. But yeah, this is ours. Because we'd, um, <clears throat> when I got it, it had, I think, nine months and pretty much zero working hours. And we did the work with it. So, this isn't bad, but it's only a meter bigger than what we have. So, nah, not worth the hassle. So, there's that. So, we do have a slightly better um, harvester. Slightly better. I mean, it's not that big a difference, considering that uh, there's darn near 100k in price difference new on the two of them. Yeah. So we have that here, and we now have both the uh, grain header and corn header. Corn, sunflower, you know, the other guy. Um, our tractors, nothing changed. Oh, want to see something really, really special? Something we have waited literally months for. Don't want to spoil it. Don't want to spoil it. Are you guys actually ready for this? You ready? Ta-da! Look at that! <laughs> we have the magic beans. Hey, if I plant one, do you think it'll make a magic bean pole? I'm sorry, I had to go there. So yeah, this uh, woo, big money maker, our lumber mill. Oh, that reminds me. Um, bump it, bump it, bump. Which one of you is? You're the dairy, so you are the flower, right? Yes, you're the grain mill. So with a big shift to pee, we are going. To find an angle we can actually see them at. And we are going to sell this. Yeah, 
Now, unfortunately, it's been there long enough that we take a hit on it, um, even with the factory mod. Okay, now, this is the new one, the grain mill more flowers. Now, this is what I originally paid for our grain mill, so um, it shouldn't be an issue at all. Should fit right back in there. Um, yeah, but it's not overlapping, is it? No, there's nothing else there. So let's turn off the uh, uh, the free mode. Okay. Boom. There we are. Okay. Now we can dump any grain in here, pretty much. And, uh, it'll give us a positive result. Now, we're obviously not going to find any harvesting contracts today. That's a for sure. <coughs> Could use a little dieseline. Okay, we still got thirty five hundred liters from our original five thousand. That's not bad. Am I close enough to uh, hit up the maintenance monkey here? No. Okay. Fair enough. Don't imagine it was much. We are full. And let's see. There we go. How much you need? $878. Okie dokie. And no, I don't care that your paint is coming off in sheets. If the paint they use is that cheap, uh, I don't see a reason for repeating particular mistakes like that. Because I don't think for a moment they would use a better quality paint. So, we obviously know they're using crappy paint to start with, so, whatever. If enough paint comes off that she starts to rust out, we'll just uh, offload it and... Uh, get ourselves something else. Now what I would really, 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 really like, this is sort of my goal, although I keep buying things and ruining it. Um, wheat, no. Barley, oats, canola. Well, we can't make flour out of canola, so I guess we don't have any other craps. So I guess what we're stuck at doing here is contracts. Which, I mean, there's no big surprise. We've been doing contracts for months. Really? Uh, only reason I came this way is because I thought it would be less of a pain in the butt than trying to squeeze it in the other side. There's a lot of these little trees that are just stupidly annoying. I don't get rid of more of them. Because our little mill is so slow. I mean, I don't want to waste them. But, yeah, our little mill is so slow that it uses like three liters of wood a day. So, yeah, there's never an empty space. Alright, well... I don't think the rain is our friend here today. So let's quickly check and make sure we're not missing out on anything too ooh -ah. Uh, bale wrapping. Round bales. Yeah, 4400 bucks. We could do that one ourselves. Uh, here's a decent sized cultivating one. 
We could have a hired worker do that. Deadwood fertilizing. Mm, nothing big. Same stupid harvesting contracts for months. Literally months. You know, this looks like a corn... Oh, sunflower. But it's a tiny little field. And it's... Well, it's not that far, I guess. And go all the way. Yeah, it's a ways. I really wish you could move this map. You know what I mean? Like it shows you it's this field. This is where you dump it. Yeah, but I'd like to know how far is that from the shop? How far is it from my farm? You know what I mean? Like why can't we move this freaking piece of map around? Well, there's a mowing job. Well, it's the same one that's been open for a while. Hmm. Big plowing job, but we know what happens, don't we? <laughs> yes. Take them all day to start with. Nothing really big at all. Uh, oh, as usual, some good land ones. Stone picking. Hmm. 7200 bucks, eh? That does give us a little extra space. Um... We're going to lose 700, so 6,500. All right, so do I want to send my guys there? Or do we want them maybe here? Because we can do this with our own gear. We'll make the $7,400. What's this one? <clears throat> oh, that's right across the road. Let's accept this. Look, he's got the same gear as us almost weird <laughs> okay we'll accept that contract okay that is for us um, All right, we'll accept this as well. Okay. So. Let's grab the big culty of Ator. this guy do it? No, he's fine. He's just down a little bit on the drizzle. All right. Now, I was watching Sooty's uh, video this morning. Although, a few days ahead, so it was a couple mornings ago. And he mentioned that he noticed watching other videos that when you were doing contracts, sometimes as soon as the contract ended, it just basically shut you down. And other times, he said he was watching some other people's videos, where he'd see they could continue through and actually finish the field. Um... So, yeah, I know generally when I'm doing that, I think you're right, buddy, that it's a matter of whether it's your kit or the farmer that owns the field. I think that might be the difference and that you're right about that. Okay, now which field? Okay, field six is the cultivating. That's just down here. So if we deek past the water, uh, and down here, and head 
head down here. Oh, didn't we just do something with this field? Pretty sure we did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. It's not a very big field. It's not tiny, but it's not that big. I don't know why I'm bothering to set it up so nice. We know the first thing the hired worker is going to do is wiggle back and forth until he finds how he wants it. Which, I mean, legitimate enough, they got to do the field, I suppose, if they have their own thing. Alright. So, headlands, yes, AI worker. Okie dokie. 7.6 meters, yeah, that's right. Go find yourself a way to do this. On the other hand, we have a wee bit further to go. Uh, field 11. I mean, it's not far. Oop. There's some good advice. <laughs> Start the engine, then drive the truck. Alright, let's head out. Uh, actually, yeah, that might be our easiest. Skip straight across. I'm just looking at the map, drifted right out into the middle of the street. I wonder how often that happens in real life. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so... The field we're after... It's kind of in the back there. I think we want to take this. Oh, that's not a road. Yeah. Well... It's a field-ish. And it gets us... Eh, where we're going. Yikes, get off the dudes. Oh, man. Here we go. This would be the grass field in question. I hope. Yeah, this is a left. I just noticed there's another one right at the end there. I say, like, uh-oh. Maybe it's not. Now, just out of curiosity, if I was to look at the steering assist, which you're not going to show me any lines. There you go. Perfect. Front ready. And you're up. Here, let's get rid of this. We don't need that in our face. Okay, so they got a 25% head start. Let's see how we did. I was just going to switch the day till tomorrow. Figure, you know, it's got to get better. This will lead to a bail contract. Don't surprise me. Ooh, missed a bit there, didn't we? Oh, well. 
Oh, for Camden's all okay. Beating us with a cultivator, too. do a 180 and come down the next row, but no, wait a minute. If I do a 43 point turn, then come at it sideways, take an inch away from the grass that's there, that's cultivating that's there. You know how the harder guys these things. They love to milk it for the drama. <laughs> Alright, oh, we almost caught him too. seen the mowers get so filthy so quick. I wonder if that has to do with the fact that we're uh, doing this in the rain. And that contributes to the mucky dirtiness of your uh, entire deal. Oh, this is going to suck. This is going to leave us that tiny little bit here on the edge. Um, there on. Which, frankly, I'm not going to Turn, baby, turn. Alright, Let's just mow this out. Why are you suddenly going so slow? One hill is just doing half the speed here and it's slowing down a lot of things. See, that's how I figured out there was an issue with the harvester. Yes, I noticed like a hired worker was doing it, but he was doing three kilometers an hour. I thought, well, you know, maybe that's some preset thing with the hired worker that they're supposed to do this ultra realistic speed when they're harvesting or something, you know. Well, I'm not going to put up with three hours watching them harvest a tiny field, so I'll take over. So I took over. And oddly enough, although I was able to get it to 5 kilometers an hour, I could tell there was something definitely awry. And yeah, that's what it turned out to be. Because I reached a certain point in the field and I noticed that the whole thing was turned like 20 degrees to the line. It was still following the line, but rather than that green line lining up with the rear hitch where it lined up with the front it was sticking out about where that uh, little reflector is above the uh, right hand mower which yeah so that's what I mean by dog legging it was just literally crabbing all the way down the field except of course they're not capable of crabbing their wheels aren't built for it so it was in fact pushing 
the uh, front of the unit like it was just simply a dead weight. Not good. Not good. Just, we just don't seem to be able to catch this contract here. Cultivator. Dang, he's gonna finish before us. He's gonna laugh. <laughs> but yeah, I finished the uh, contract with that header. And uh, yeah, it. it it's weird too, because it left these really weird, almost chalk-looking lines in the field. I guess where it was sort of bouncing the header as it tried to, you know, force it over the next hump type of thing. But I got through it. And like I said, I was looking to see if there was any deals on the different corn header, because they're not cheap. My God. You know, because I got that one on a deal, but, uh, rather than a corn header being on deal, the, uh, cultivator, or the, uh, harvester actually fit was on that deal, so, yeah. More money than I wanted to spend, and it meant I ended up spending about an extra two hours in-game making it up with contracts, but did a couple of stone-picking contracts. They take a while, but the one actually netted me, that was it, 7,200 liters of stone? So yeah, it was like a thousand dollars on top of my normal, uh... And next to harvesting, it is the only, uh, the only one that does give you the extra bucks that way. I imagine the, uh, Deadwood one does as too, because it says you can sell the logs once you cut them out. Right, but, yeah. We are so far from being able to do that. But we're still not catching that guy. <laughs> Yeah, I think we'll probably be out here uh, either bailing or at least bale wrapping, depending on what the uh, the farmer does compared to the contract. No, not that one. Bugger off. be doing like almost exactly the same amount of that. Because every time we catch up, a second later he's ahead again. We're caught up, and he's ahead. Okay, now we're at the end of the road. Eighty to eighty-one. Eventually he's gotta hit the end of the road and we'll catch up. Maybe right now he isn't going anywhere from well eighty one. Tide. Are we gonna get ahead? We did. There we go. Ah, suck it, iron worker, you terrible. Look at that. Two percent ahead of you. Three percent. Oh, you're just never gonna catch us. You had your moments. Even if it was really. And yeah, I know it's valiant, but the other way always seem more suitable. Okay, come on, baby. Let's get this done. 
go and make us some money. Yeah, my springtime goal, if possible, if we can land. I, I really don't know what we're going to do without uh, borrowing or stealing or some other method of gaining more money. Is to have a cow farm. Not a cow farm, but a cow barn. Once spring starts. And of course with the new thing Giants has decided to throw into the mix with cows, where you have to have at least a quarter million dollar cow shed before they'll let you milk from it for some stupid reason. And it really surprises me that no one's modded a cow shed that you can get the damn milk out of. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, they bothered to make a flour mill that takes grains that the other one wanted. And yet the cow barn, which has kind of I'm sure made a lot of people go, well, screw it, that I ain't raising cows. You know, you don't make a lot off them as meat cows compared to the ongoing joy of the milk cow. So. But, no, no luck yet. No, maybe, but, oh, 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 I'm sorry. You actually have to follow the line, dude. Oh, I might have ruined it this close. Go, go, they're catching up. That really allowed him some catching up room. Ninety-eight. Ninety-nine. So we'll be able to tell on this field if they'll allow us to. Okay, the contract's finished. Nope, this is my own gear. And as you can see, we are in fact allowed to continue on. And allowed to continue on with it actually working. Assuming I'm going to get paid to a gun. That's better. And boom. And we still finished. Before the other guy. There we are. He just finished his contract. Awesome. Oh, let's... Uh, Let's turn the lines off, because they are annoying. There we go. Okay. Okay. So, uh, I think the highway's way the heck up there. Huh? Yes. Although, to be fair, There is a road here. No, I don't want to go that way. I do not. I do not. I want to get to that road over there. Man. I'm almost embarrassed to bring these behind the tractor. They're so filthy. Oops. Get off the guy's field, man. Rain's right there. There it goes. Uh, under the bridge? Mm, yeah, I don't think so. Don't 100% trust that these are going to work. But. You are definitely parking there, dude. And you. Nice job. Hi, hi. Yes.
Dude, look. What the heck, man? <laughs> that is not how we do a job here. There you go. Thank you. Whoa. Coming up the hill. There you go. And get straight on to our place. So yeah, I was fairly careful when I put the new green hoses in to pick things that I thought would uh, do well in our little farm market. So I've got uh, chili peppers, onions, uh, spring onions, that is, um, what else? garlic, indeed, and tomatoes. So basically uh, a really nice uh, salsa mix. Or similar. Okay, let's go and uh, de scumify this thing best we can. Present your lance. Noble. Alright, start with the tracker. And then we'll give the snares a wash. Good God. It's grass wedged right in between all the bits and bobs. Oh, come on. For the money I paid, they could have used like a three meter hose anyway. Uh, cleans up nice, considering those are cloth. Well. At least I don't have to peel them off and throw them in the laundry. Oh. I think it's got such a big hitbox. Not to mention I always forget it even has one. So I tend to stand too close to it and try to jump back into my machines. Only to find a no-no. I'm actually just pushing the uh, power washer into the yard. Yeah, let's pop him down, we're done. That is the wrong order, unfortunately. I usually like to have the other one out first. I guess it doesn't. Alright, let's collect our contract. Hmm, that was kind of weird the way the uh, rain noise is faded out. So, let's collect. Okay. And let's collect. Alright, not a huge amount of money. So, uh, well, at all. There's another fairly large cultivating job. Hmm. But I think... 126k... I think what I'm gonna do at this point... Um... Yeah... Maybe we can get it to stop raining. Walter! Well, I guess he doesn't stand around in the rain. He probably went inside, eh? That's kind of weird. Now that he's not around, maybe I'll sell his farm. 
Um, well, no guarantees it's going to be that bright when we wake up. 7 in the morning in November could be a little dangerous. But heck, I get up in the dark every day in real life. So, nah, it's not bad. Three dollars property income, why? Do our solar panels not count because it's like wintry? Extended reach, what's a J M and X? J and M extended reach. Hmm? Oh. It's just a trailer? Yeah, it's just a trailer. It does hold a fair chunk, wow. But yeah, that's uh, that's all it is. Hmm. So. Contract day. What do you got? Still the same bale wrap. Still the same cultivating. That one as well. Hmm. This one and this one need cultivated. 40 and 14. Uh, no, they're nowhere near there. We got all these dead wood. Fertilizing. Again, the same stupid harvesting contracts that have been there for three months now. There's the big plowing contract. Another big stone pick. Hmm. Of course, we have to lease the equipment for those because I don't have an actual stone picker. And that's a long ways up the hill. And then wood transport. Yeah, I guess the... Uh, I guess these are getting a little bit scarce, eh? Uh, fertilizing... This is about the only other one, is this cultivator one. So, let's... Yeah, this guy doesn't do... The, the, the hired worker doesn't do well <laughs> with these things. Um, hmm. But I gotta make money somehow. I mean, I could use ours, but for the difference I'd make up, how big is this? This looks like it's a much bigger plow um, than what we've got. But, mm, $800. Probably that much wear and tear on my gear doing it ourselves. So let's borrow, okay. And then we'll take uh, this one as well. And we will just accept the contract. Okay. So, the Kubota. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, wait a minute. Um, did I accept the gear on that other one? I did. Okay. Let's get this put together first. Huh. Funny, the game advised when you're buying a plow to have wheel weights. And yet, I've kind of been looking, and each plowing contract we've taken that's been borrowed gear, they've given us a tractor that does not have. So, let's fold this plow up so we can get it where we're going. And then let's figure out where that is. I believe that would be field plowing 51. Alright, both of these jobs are actually uh, darn near the same, aren't they? Hmm. So, how's about uh, if we do this. Now, field 51. Uh, 51, here we go. Let's set you here. Hmm. 
Okay. Uh, what, do I have to do this over again to cancel that then? How about... Here. There we go, driving to target. Excellent. So, let's, uh, leapeth. So that's the plowing. Our contract is cultivating. So we're gonna meet him up there. do. Basically just following that other dude. up the line a little bit. There we go. ahead of us somewhere. He just keeps getting around the corner before we can catch up. There he is. Hey, dude. Don't go crashing into nothing, eh? Alright, so we want to go this way, too. Okay. And he should be coming to a stop soon. In fact, and H. Stop, man. Where are you going? <laughs> um, 51? Yeah, okay. Well, actually, I guess you're, you can carry on this way. And uh, 51 is down here. Ooh, across this funky bridge. And it's this one. Okay. Well, I'll leave it all up to you. So, the H key. Start with the headland. And, uh, 4.5 meter plow. Okay. H. Now, us, on the other hand... Oops. <laughs> Drive the tractor. Dude. 
we're going up to this crazy piece of land here. Well, I'm mean, gonna have to uh, take a little tickle into this farmer's field, or we're never gonna make this gate. There we go. Alright, let's uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick this up. Okay, do I want to do this or do I want to hire a dude to do this? <laughs> um, yeah, heck with it. Let's do this ourselves. Okay. Drop you down. Let's go. Nice yeah, idea. I take it they're promoting multiplayer? <laughs> Family that seeds together, weeds together. percent for the plow. We must be doing better than that last guy. Although, I'll be completely honest, I am both fascinated and terrified of the thought of actually walking up what he's doing. <laughs> yeah. If he's doing the weeble, 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 weeble all the way up the field again. I mean, it worked. They counted the field as done. They gave us the money. They told us to go home. They liked the job. Should do. It should do. Mm, pretty much neck and neck on this one. I mean, we should have the advantage. We do have a much more larger piece of kit. But I think overall, the fields are about the same size. Now I do have the mod installed that should give me more field information and I think it gives you the actual uh, square hectares? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I've never had to uh, deal with the derivatives of that word. I'm not sure what the proper uh, terms are. But uh, yeah, it supposedly includes... Well, let's check it out. I mean, what the heck? 
Now here we go, safe farmland owned, field 40 area, 1.95 heca acres, land area, 2.58. I guess the entire chunk of land? You know what I mean? Like when you buy a field, you usually get a little bit of goofiness around it one way or the other, whether it's a little patch of trees or, you know, unfarmable stone or who knows what. But yeah, you usually get something. So I guess that's what that second number is. He actually owns from the road all the way around up there, that little bush of trees to the road there. So that makes sense. But there you go. So we can actually know who did the bigger field. And you can beat our chests and bleed or tuck our tail in humiliation. No, it's just 50 50. 6 of 1, 33 of 1. I'm sorry, 33 of 3rd. Ah, we're smoking them now. Catch the right one. There we are. Blah, blah. Oh no. Dun dun dun. Yeah, I'm sorry. It, it was, there was just so much trauma involved. I will, I will never be comfortable in the presence of a school bus again. School bus incident of 2024. <laughs> it actually wasn't that weird. He just jackknifed me right between the truck and the trailer to the point where we were completely seized in both directions. Not fun. Not fun. Follow the green line this time. See you back here when we're just about done. Alrighty, as you can see, we are just about to finish this one. Uh, not so. Uh, okay, we're done. But I'm mean, again. We will, uh, you know, do the job we were paid to do. We're not just going to be slackers and bugger off because oh look, the boss said we could go home early. Boss has no work ethic. That's the boss's problem. There we are. Now, we've actually finished the contract. But it seems to me, wasn't there, yeah, 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 a, uh, I don't want active workers, what are you doing? Wasn't there another cultivating contract, K55? Where the heck are we? Where? Hang on. Um, just straight map. We are field 40. So 52, 50, 49, all that sort of stuff. Uh, 52, 50, 49. No, I thought there was another field like right next door. I guess they must have done it. Or decided they didn't want to. I don't know. But okay. Um, let's send you. That would be you. 
we will set your destination. Oops, wrong way. As back home. So let's say, no heck, right in the middle. Um, that's the main road. These are the entrance ways. So let's stick you here facing that way. No? Okay. Let's try... Where are you? Ah, there you are. Set destination. There we go. And he's on his way. So, let's bounce to... Oh god, here we go. Huh. Uh, oh, I know. Looks like we had... Well, those lines are straight, but there's little bits of... Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy enough with that. I think we can let him uh, carry on. But, where are you going? Oh, I see. I'm just gonna spin till I win. No, wait a minute. I'm confused. Where was I? So you can understand why it takes them a little longer to do things than it takes us. What are you going to do? You're going to trim off that little edge? You are. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> I'm going to let him uh, fumble on because, you know, um, yeah. Seems to be what we get to do. But this one's completed. Let's collect that 7,500 bucks anyway. <laughs> there we go. 133k. Well, it's not a cow farm, but it ain't spring either yet. Oh, well, the amount of rain. Hard to say. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do, folks. Please remember to hit that like button before you uh, step away. Till next time. Take good care of each other. Have yourselves a wonderful day. And ciao.